At the Missouri History Museum, we have Mighty Mississippi, which is an exhibit that takes in a long history of our life in this region where the Middle Mississippi River is vital to cities like St. Louis and has been a large part of why people have settled in this region and why it's going to be so important for our future. We're looking at a long view of the Mississippi River and what it means for us today. So there are over 200 artifacts in this exhibit. Some of them have never been on display before. Many of them haven't been on display in decades. So this is an opportunity for people to come and experience a deep history of our relationship with the river. People need to know how important this place is. This is where the fur trade started in the middle of North America at St. Louis. This is where Native Americans lived for centuries. A thousand years ago, the Mississippian people started their communities here at Cahokia and on this side of the Mississippi River in Missouri. This is an enormous exhibit. We have so many important objects. From the fur trade era, we have a really important kind of gun. It was a type of gun traded for almost 200 years. It's called a Northwest gun. So this was traded to the Native Americans. It was made in Europe. It was brought here and then traded out of uh, the fur trade center of St. Louis. So there are also amazing objects from the steamboat era. There's a beautiful bell from a steamboat called the Elvira that was built in 1851. It weighs six to 700 pounds. We also have the pilot house of the Golden Eagle, which was a steamboat that plied the Mississippi River and many of the other large western rivers. That steamboat was the last of its kind. It was a wooden hulled packet boat that was based out of St. Louis. It originally was built uh, for the packet trade down to uh, New Orleans and Natchez and was acquired in 1918 by a St. Louis company called the Eagle Packet Company and they rechristened it the Golden Eagle and they used that boat until it was sank in 1947. The pilot house remained dry, it was salvaged, and we eventually got it into our collection. That's a big artifact, it's the largest one in this exhibit. It's about 13 foot square and about 17 feet high. This object, the Golden Eagle Pilot House, is one of the largest in the Missouri Historical Society's collection. There are maybe only two other objects quite as large, one of them being the copy of Lindbergh's Spirit of St. Louis airplane, which hangs in our loggia outside this gallery. There are also objects like three plummets on display. These objects were uh, used probably about 5,000 years ago by the people who came to this area before the Mississippian people. So the Native Americans living and working around the river systems were using these as some kind of a tool. It's a, a wonderfully designed exhibit that really gives you a sense of the Mississippian period culture. It gives you a great sense of the industrial era when steamboats ruled the day. There are all sorts of uh, other interactives and experiences that people can have to understand more about the relationship with the river. The Mighty Mississippi exhibit runs at the Missouri History Museum until April 18, 2021. It's free and open to the public, and for more information, you can check out mohistory.org.